NVIDIA announced its new line, line of AI processors. The CEO, Jensen Wong, announcing the new architecture. It's dubbed Rubin, and that comes ahead of the Computex tech conference that's being held in Taipei. But our next generation platform is called Rubin. So we have the Rubin platform, and one year later, we have the Rubin um, Ultra platform. NVIDIA just unveiled a new AI Ultra chip that has the industry reeling. This isn't just an incremental upgrade. We're talking about next-level performance that shatters expectations. It promises to transform everything from AI research to everyday applications. But what exactly makes this chip so groundbreaking? Let's find out. NVIDIA's new AI Ultra chips. In recent years, there has been a big rush to develop AI technology. Lots of companies are jumping on the bandwagon, introducing new features, tools, and chatbots that use this advanced technology. This AI boom is a modern-day gold rush, with everyone trying to get in on the action. Because of this surge in AI development, companies need hardware that can handle all the complex operations involved. The companies that make computer chips have been working hard to create faster and more efficient hardware to power these AI systems. They're putting in a lot of effort to make sure the technology can keep up with the demand and work effectively. Now, NVIDIA, a big player in computer graphics and AI technology, has just revealed a new chip ahead of the Computex Tech Conference in Taipei. This announcement has made the company even more valuable. NVIDIA is known for making powerful chips that help computers handle graphics and AI tasks. The next generation Ultra chip called Rubin is set to be released in 2026. NVIDIA's new AI chip is named in honor of Vera Florence Cooper Rubin, an astronomer famous for discovering dark matter. Rubin will push the boundaries of AI technology even further, potentially transforming how AI is used in various industries. For instance, AI could become more effective in areas like healthcare, where it can help doctors diagnose diseases, or in transportation, where it could improve self-driving cars. NVIDIA Corporation's CEO, Jensen Huang, shared that the company has big plans to improve its AI accelerators every year. He announced that in 2025, they will launch a new chip called Blackwell Ultra. This chip is expected to be even more powerful and advanced than their current offerings. Rubin comes months after the March announcement of the upcoming Blackwell model, which is still in production and expected to ship to customers later in 2024. This new chip, Rubin, is the next big thing in NVIDIA. With the introduction of the Rubin architecture, NVIDIA is once again setting new standards for AI performance and efficiency, catering to a wide range of industries and applications. Rubin chip promises enhanced performance and capabilities compared to its predecessors. Staying ahead of competition. Huang's announcement of Rubin seems to speed up NVIDIA's already fast-paced development of AI chips. Previously, the company would update its AI chips every two years. However, they have now shifted to releasing updates every year. This new, faster pace shows how dedicated NVIDIA is to staying at the forefront of AI technology. The Rubin platform is part of this effort to push boundaries and innovate more quickly. Through the acceleration of its development schedule, NVIDIA aims to bring new and improved AI capabilities to market faster than ever before. This means industries that rely on AI, such as healthcare, finance, and autonomous driving, can expect to see rapid advancements and more powerful tools soon. NVIDIA is moving quickly from its current project, Blackwell, to a new platform called Rubin in less than three months. This rapid change highlights the intense competition in the AI chip market and how fast things are moving in the world of AI technology. Hence, NVIDIA's efforts to maintain its leading position. Huang talked about how we are on the brink of a big change in computing. He explained that NVIDIA's new ideas in AI and faster computing are expanding what can be done with technology. These innovations are pushing the limits and are expected to drive the next big wave of technological advancements. Huang's announcement shows NVIDIA's strong commitment to innovation. The company is focused on staying ahead in the rapidly evolving field of AI. The Rubin platform will feature new graphics processing units, which are important for training and launching AI systems. These GPUs are essential because they handle the complex calculations and data processing required for AI to work effectively. Alongside the new GPUs, 
Rubin will include other advanced components, such as a central processor that will work with the GPUs to boost overall performance. One of the key features of Rubin will be NVLink 6, a technology that enables faster communication between GPUs and other components. This will allow for more efficient data transfer, speeding up AI tasks, and making the system more powerful. Additionally, Rubin will include the CX-9 Super NIC, which is a high-performance network interface card, and the X1600 converged InfiniBand Ethernet switch. These networking technologies will enhance the platform's ability to handle large amounts of data quickly and efficiently, which is important for advanced AI applications. While NVIDIA has shared some exciting aspects of the Rubin platform, specific details about the new chips and their capabilities have not yet been disclosed. However, the combination of new GPUs, advanced networking features, and other innovative technologies suggests that Rubin could set a new standard for AI platforms. The AI chips in the Rubin platform will feature next-generation high-bandwidth memory, a type of advanced computer memory. This memory will be provided by leading manufacturers SK Hynix, Micron, and Samsung. High-bandwidth memory allows for faster data processing and more efficient performance, which is crucial for handling the large and complex tasks involved in AI work. These improvements in memory technology mean that the Rubin platform will be capable of processing vast amounts of data quickly, making it highly effective for various AI applications. This could include everything from advanced machine learning models to real-time data analysis and even more sophisticated AI-driven simulations. The AI chip race is heating up. NVIDIA's decision to speed up the development of its next-generation platform, Rubin, shows its strategy to stay ahead of major competitors like AMD and Intel. These two companies are working hard to catch up to NVIDIA, but their profit margins were lower than NVIDIA's in the most recent fiscal quarter. This shows that NVIDIA is currently more profitable and possibly more efficient in its operations. In addition to AMD and Intel, big tech companies like Microsoft, Google, and Amazon are also trying to take NVIDIA's top spot. These companies are developing their processors to compete in the AI market. Interestingly, even though they are competing with NVIDIA, they are also some of NVIDIA's biggest customers. They buy a lot of NVIDIA's products for their AI projects. There is a high number of startups entering the AI technology space. These new companies are bringing fresh ideas and innovations, creating even more competition for NVIDIA. The tech industry is rapidly evolving, with many players striving to lead in AI advancements. NVIDIA's quick development of the Rubin platform is a clear move to maintain its leadership. Since the announcement of their new Rubin chip, the shares have stayed stable. NVIDIA is making big moves to become the most valuable company in the world. Right now, NVIDIA's market value is $2.695 trillion, putting it in third place among the world's most valuable companies. Microsoft and Apple are both slightly ahead of NVIDIA, with their market values around $3 trillion. Google comes in fourth place with a market value of $2,139 trillion. NVIDIA's strong position in the market shows how much confidence investors have in the company's future and its ability to keep innovating. We are at the beginning of an incredibly exciting time for the industry, as AI transforms virtually every business, improves our quality of life, and reshapes every part of the computing market. NVIDIA is a major player in the AI chip market, holding 70% of AI semiconductor sales. However, it's not the only company making big advancements since the rise of AI. AMD, another big name in the industry, has also announced a new chip that will be available at the end of 2024. This shows that AMD is actively working to compete in the AI chip market and bring innovative products to the table. Intel, another well-known chip maker, is also striving to make its AI chips more competitive. Although Intel hasn't announced a new chip since late 2023, it remains in the race to develop more advanced AI technology. Intel is working on improving its existing products and ensuring they remain relevant in the rapidly evolving AI industry. The competition among these companies is fierce, as each one aims to create the most powerful and efficient AI chips. This competition is beneficial for the industry because it drives innovation and leads to the development of better technology.
As NVIDIA prepares to launch its next-generation Rubin platform in 2026, it will face strong competition from AMD and Intel, each striving to capture a larger share of the AI chip market. Even with the competition, NVIDIA has been making big strides in the tech world, particularly with its AI efforts. Over the last few months, these advancements have pushed NVIDIA to become the third most valuable company in the world. The company's dedication to innovation and the rapid development of cutting-edge AI technology have played a key role in its rise. The announcements about new projects like the Rubin platform have further solidified NVIDIA's reputation in the tech industry. If you have made it this far, let us know what you think in the comment section below. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.